today I am playing Dirk the Adventurer. So let's see. We're started off with a stat management screen. So we can't go any weaker than one, and we have one point. So either we're strong, we can read, we can sneak, you can jump, <laughs> and not scary face. Okay, cool. So let's go with stealth for now. Okay, now I'll probably forget these controls, but they seem pretty simple. Let's begin. Let's begin. There we go. Where am I? What's happening? I am locked. Oh, am I locked? Did I drink too much beer again? Is it at least still demo day? I don't know about that. I better look for the exit. Yep, that's true. Yeah, fonts, okay. I do wish it was a little bit more readable, but you know. Oh, nice, you can sit down. I don't like how he looks at me. <laughs> so you can push things. Um, oh, okay, wait, can you change stats or? Nope, okay. Um, so tab for inventory. Okay, so we got a... Oh, hey, kid. Were you just talking to me? Don't pretend you didn't try to talk to a mounted animal head before. I'm losing my mind. Hmm. Abandoned mansion, look for the exit or perish. Oh, this is a lot of dialogue. Anyway, how do I play Mr. Head? Okay, so the reason why I can't jump then, I'm assuming, is because I only have a 1 in agility. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, yep, combination, my favorite type of puzzle logic. Get no saving. It's a little bit difficult to tell who's talking, so, you know, some sort of nameplate or whatever would be great. What are you doing sneaking? Okay. I do this. Okay, so now I'm sneaking. Can I steal from him or something? Not really sure. Okay, we have climbing, <laughs> kinda. Okay, we got a key. Okay, falling doesn't kill us. Now oh, that's fun, pushing against the infinite void. It's probably something deep if you look into that. Anyway, let's get out of here. Okay, I probably need to um, go to inventory and then use it. Or maybe I have to put it in my hand. If it's cool. Yep, leaving's easy. Wow, that feels... Hmm. And I guess it's fine if the camera doesn't scroll smoothly. What do we have here? Some blocks. We got a something? Okay, broken loot. Okay, what's back here? Okay, we don't have the strength to push this. Okay, picked up some flour. We picked up a whole bunch of bottles. What's your deal? Thank the heavens, someone finally showed up. Oh, he's the bard. <laughs> okay then, so supposedly this guy was totally in the right and then he got mugged. I'm not sure if I fully believe him. Sitting in this prison cell, 
waiting for my final bell. Join me in my plight to run, or I'll never again see the sun. I hope you'll help me from my quarry. I'm out of rhymes, sorry. Okay. Wow, that's really impressive. Okay. Uh, maybe I can, I can give him that broken loot. <laughs> I don't think he would appreciate that. Um, let's do it anyway. How do I use it on the world, I wonder? Oops. I made... Am I making bread? Grains? Okay, brains for absorbing wine. I will say, having the smooth fade between rooms feels a bit weird, considering everything is very pixelated otherwise. What do we have here? A book. A book on the bookshelf. <laughs> Okay, we can't make this without jumping, basically. Yep. Can't go to the right. Okay, go upstairs. Got a door. Okay, it's locked. Hello, how are you doing? Pecker. Okay. I'll just take your ash, if you don't mind. Okay. Got a whole bunch of nothing. This looks like something I can maybe platform on? Okay, I can. Okay, that didn't feel exactly normal to walk on, but okay, that's interesting. Why is that happening? Okay, then. There's another door. There's a beggar. There's an actual beggar in the rafters. Hello there. <laughs> wow, of course he's the vain one. Nice. We got a free rat. Worth it. Okay, so one way to get out is by sneaking or fighting through the gardens, apparently. Okay, and this is a shortcut. Hello there, bud. Okay, right, I need to pretend to be his nephew, otherwise he's probably gonna kill me. Uh, she's quite well. some wine. We have a prisoner downstairs. <laughs> Damn right. Cole tried to steal all my valuables. Hmm. Oh wait, is the joke that Dirk was the one who stole all the valuables? And then the bard got misappropriated? Okay, then, this guy's cuckoo. Can't open the door, it seems. I'm assuming the key wouldn't magically work. Okay.
Okay then, so I guess we're gonna go ahead and walk out from the from the goblin area. Hmm? That's weird. Why is she? Oh, what? I didn't realize that was a cupboard. I had no clue this was a cupboard. I thought it was like a weird screening wall. Hey, look over here. Oh, wait, I took it anyway. Oh, and the game crashed from the hairbrush. Nice. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna reset the game now. That's interesting, I'm somehow controlling the game state while in this cutscene. Uh, is it gonna end? Okay, there we are. So yeah, I can actually make him climb up or down on that state, it's kind of funny. Get me out of here. I'm curious, so will this, will I not be able to pretend to be the nephew if I don't know it? Well, let's do it differently anyway. Oh, okay. <laughs> I have to do it anyway. Oh, wait, can we climb this? No. Okay. A bellflower. Table decoration. Okay. Let's drop down. Oh. Okay, this cupboard also has something. Old yellow paper. Now it kind of looks like a map. Huh. Interesting. Oh, I see. So the joke is probably to trick the, uh, the uncle. But let's try this. No, whoops. Yeah, that didn't work out too well. Oh, that's funny. These wood panels hide the health UI in the top left. I guess I want the opposite. I don't know. Let's just climb. Get me out of here. Okay, this looks like a good enough direction. And out I go. Finally, clean air. That's interesting, I fell. Oh, why did I fall there? That was weird. Oh, I wanted to check if I could go into the door. Oh, and we got a, a babe. You scared my horse. What? You still owe me money. You entered town illegally <laughs> and you set my field on fire. Okay, this is pretty good. Goblins, run. Goblin end. Well, screw you, buddy. I was exploring. Oh, we get more the more we play? Okay. Okay, then. Give me strength. Give me agility. 
All right, so now I should be able to jump with shift. Yep. Yeah, controls are a little bit awkward and it's kind of giving me the cramps a little bit because I don't like using my left hand to input ZXC, but oh well. Don't be a weakling, I tell myself. Okay, so what do I do with my jump ability? Kind of forget actually. So I think there was something over here you could jump for. Nope, it was elsewhere. But I can't push this, or can I? Really? I don't have the strength? Okay. Okay, now I can get this book. There we go. Book acquired. What do you say for yourself? Handwritten important book. Very nice. Hmm. I probably need jump level two to be able to get up further. Go back across. Can I do this? Nope, I can't. Or can I? Nope. Okay, I thought I could maybe grab onto the tarp mid jump and then jump back across. Yeah, so I'm going to try the map thing next. And that's going to require going to the goblin area and then coming back down with the paper. Right, okay, and that's why this shortcut is here. So that you can get those items and then come back quickly. Good. Oh, uncle, I found a treasure map. Huh, kind of surprised he's being <laughs> so hard to convince. But <laughs> throws it on the ground. Nice. Maybe I need to have charisma to convince him? Okay, I guess I'm gonna go through another loop then. I have a present for you, a beautiful flower. Not going to examine it though. <laughs> he then calls me a beggar in the same breath. A woman, am I right? <laughs> okay. Oh, there is something to the right. Oh, come on. I'll give another couple tries. It's a miracle Dirk doesn't break his back. Oh, come on. It's outrageous. It's unfair. Okay. <laughs> okay, then. That's weird. I wasn't expecting them to be able to walk up the <laughs> lattice like that. Oh, right. I can actually come in through the front door if I want. What? Why, why can you do that? Okay, that annoys me, actually. You should be on the other side of the door. Ugh. Yeah, so the only difference this time around is my charm and my intelligence. So I'm not really sure what that'll get me. I guess there's the beggar <laughs> who won't give me a rat. But besides that, I'm not really sure. Okay, she has a problem. She left her birdcage open. Find a sparrow. So that means that the bird is probably locked behind the very top of this area. Here, have this flower. Or 
I guess not. I wonder why I can't give it to her. Let's see, can we convince Mr. Bates? <laughs> okay, yet another dead end. Okay, hopefully next time we'll get enough strength and or jumping power to unlock something and then we'll see what happens. There we go. Okay, now we can jump further and we have more strength. So now we can fight with a sword, however we don't have a sword still. Hey, what? We have some debug text? I can't leave Tavra until I pay for my drinks? Okay then. Look at that movement speed though, very nice. Wait, what? What just happened? Okay, I didn't... There we go. I had to stand specifically right in front of the lock. Okay, now we're good. We can push the crate. Oh, secret passage. Secret tunnel. Yeah, let's check it out. Treasure chest. Nice. Okay, now we got a sword. Um, all right, probably need to equip that. Very good. Okay. Do have some debug text, but that's fine. I do wonder if our key can open this. Let's try it. Too bad. Hmm. My only thought with the bard piece is that maybe you can use the hairbrush so like you get the hairs to form a string and then you could use that perhaps. I'm just worried. So I'm going to try that last just in case it crashes the game because I don't want to have to redo all this again. set of keys. However, I got a set of keys. Come now. Here's the bird, probably. Wait, no? Not a bird. Unless the bird's in the chest, that'd be pretty funny. So now I should be able to do this. Nope. Oh wait, perhaps I need a higher sneaking level to use those um, lock picks. That's probably why. Yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, if I hold down right here, that happens. Oh, right, I need to actually kill them all if I want to get the new ending. Fool, die. Man, this feels kind of messed up. 
It's so sad and pathetic. Oh, wait, I missed something here. Fountain pen. Have you used the pen on the map? No. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Guess I'll just continue killing for now. Okay, all dead. Hey, what? I killed them all. Why are they here? Or maybe it will end because I'll kill them instead of run away. What do you mean? Okay. Okay, now I should be able to lockpick. So, that's useful. Do I have intelligence now? Okay, I can actually read this book. There we go. I'm assuming the bird's gonna be in here. We got a bow and arrow? Okay then. Broken belt. Bow. Okay. Okay, wow, that weapons position thing is going crazy right now. Yeah, there's some um, cursor selection for the um, for the stash inventory, I guess, when you're trying to collect something. Should probably reset to the first slot every time you open it. It would also be nice if it would automatically close when you're done, but I don't know. Probably just open this. Okay, so I can probably... All right, where was the fountain pen? Okay, I guess I can't open it for some reason. Okay, I need a direct order from the crown. Oh, there we are. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so you <laughs> wind the belt to make it into a seal. Okay, so now what I need is to get some ink to then write on the paper. Oh, right, was it this one? There we go. So now we can do this. We have orders and then boom. You fool. We have orders to do it. <laughs> okay. Whoa, he's moonwalking. Watch out. Okay, yep. Aha, pirates, my boys, stay aside. <laughs> it's the insane admiral. Okay, finally got a new ending. Okay, let's just go full stealth so that we don't have to get the keys anymore. Seems good. 
Okay, he has nothing. <laughs> Stealing from a prisoner. That's just wrong. Oh, well. Actually, there's no reason to pick up the weapon. We'll just leave it. What did I get? Oh wait, I still need the keys? Hmm. That's a bit annoying. I have a coin. And then I'll steal the coin. <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna try walking out the front door then. Hey, we're out of here. <clears throat> okay, and then we get the run ending. Neat. give ourselves high agility now we're going to go for a fast ending so we're going to whoop, jump up here uh, oh, hey. okay i don't know why that happened anyway that's funny he jumped over the trigger what, what do you mean super long? Okay, whatever, man. Liar. Okay, let's do this a couple more times just so we can get everything. Hmm, that's pretty cool. I like all the little descriptions. However, it's been... A little difficult to read because of the controls, but yeah, very cool. Yeah, I will say it's a little bit inconsistent when you need to use keys from the inventory versus just using them, you know? I can't go back down. Seeing so if I can jump over to the left. Okay, whatever. seem to find the bird. Just absolutely decimating these guys. <laughs> One teleport through the map. Oh, they keep coming back. Okay. Oh, great, it crashed. Well, I'm going to call it good enough, I guess. Okay, I'll see if I can combine the hairbrush with the, with the loot on a new save. That should be possible. Okay, give her the flower. Okay, now I can grab this unimpeded. Now I need to get the bard and combine them. Nice, okay. 
Now I can give it to the bard. There you go, Mr. Bard. Or, I guess go through the dialogue first. I won't let me give it to him. Okay, I give up. I'm just gonna call it good because it's getting a bit late. Yeah, besides all the glitches, the game is pretty fun. I like the interactions and the and the item combination is okay. It's not particularly special, but it's also not particularly moon logic, so I guess that's good. The one thing which I didn't really consider was using the red wine <laughs> as a for stamp pressing, but besides that it was it was easy enough to figure out. So yeah. Just Keep on making the game.